Hello everyone. So I figured I would do a video to quickly go over the 2000 plus diet I talked about. It's actually known as Lean and Free 2000 Plus by Dana Thornock. And you would have to, to be able to really find out about this diet by the book. But trying to get the books is hard because they are actually out of print. And so you will only find use, used versions of this book. Um, there's a few things that I feel are really good about this. Um, and I've used it in the past and it's worked. And then I quit doing it for a while. And that's when I put on weight. And it's been really hard being married with a family who's not used to doing it. Um, I've gotten a lot of pushback from my family, not because of the meals and stuff, but they don't want to take the time to cook. Different things like that. And in their mind, they're set on certain ways of doing things. And we all know how that is, etc. And... With chronic illness, it can be harder when you don't have your spouse on board. Um, when you don't have the energy to do it and they're like, well, this is what we're going to do. It's hard to say, no, we need to do this other thing. So the basic premise is some of the big things that are good about it. One, she focuses on not necessarily weight loss. But inches lost. A big thing about this to understand is that muscles weigh more than fat. So you can be really thin and overweight. I actually had a friend who was less than 10% body weight. And yet she was in the overweight category. And I think I went through that previously. But or you can be in a healthy weight range and be over and be obese because you actually have too much of a body fat percentage. So keep that in mind. Um, the sec uh, So I really like she focuses on inches. Another thing she focuses on is eating all the food groups. She actually, she says at every meal you should get water vegetable, grains, protein, and fruit in that order. Um, breakfast, you can leave out the vegetables um, if that's too hard, but if you can, getting those is really good. And that's actually where my family struggles is my husband will usually do a grain with a meat, and that's it. <laughs> and so you can see how that's, especially when you're supposed to do it in that order, when he does add in a vegetable, the vegetables less than the meat. And so um, eating healthy always includes more vegetables than anything else. And when you're going to do over 2,000 calories or a higher calorie, especially first building up, everyone says you should eat more vegetables. And so that's something to be aware of. And she also focuses on the water. Of course, with EDS, you probably need to make that an electrolyte drink. So there's that. She focuses on exercise. Um, using your health and energy wisely. Gaining knowledges, knowledge and nurturing your mind through positive self-talk in other ways. Um... Just different things like that that can be very beneficial to helping to get out of the starvation mode. But if you aren't aware, you can fall back in it decently easy, even though it's a... So it's a, once again a lifestyle and not a diet, like I talked about in previous videos. And if you can't, like anything, if you can't reach the lifestyle then you're going to, it's not going to work for you. So I hope that helps with that one and maybe gives you some ideas. There's others online that give ideas of a 2000 plus diet 
and can help. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next video.